One thing that stood out to me from Mark's gospel while I was doing the Mark drama is the compassion of Jesus. Mark tells us a story of a woman who'd been bleeding for many years and no matter what she did, no one, not even a doctor or any medication would help. And what we see is that Jesus tells her that it wasn't just by magic touching his cloak that healed her, but it was her faith in him in who he was. He brings her to the attention of the whole crowd, not to embarrass her about her illness, but to free her from the shame of it so that she can have joy and freedom again. And this is a joy and freedom that she's found from trusting Christ. She came to him in weakness and in brokenness. And Jesus met her with compassion. And the Mark drama and Mark's gospel reminded me that I can come to Jesus, as can you, in weakness and brokenness. And he meets us with love and compassion. And that is the only thing that can bring us peace, real peace, here. A large crowd followed and pressed around him. And a woman was there who had been subject to bleeding for 12 years. She had suffered a great deal under many doctors and had spent all she had. Yet instead of getting better, she grew worse. When she heard about Jesus, she came up behind him in the crowd and touched his cloak because she thought, if I just touch his clothes, I will be healed. Immediately, her bleeding stopped and she felt in her body that she was freed from her suffering. At once, Jesus realised that power had gone out from him. He turned around in the crowd and asked, who touched my clothes? You see all the people crowding against you, his disciples answered, and yet you can ask, who touched me? But Jesus kept looking around to see who had done it. Then the woman, knowing what had happened to her, came and fell at his feet and, trembling with fear, told him the whole truth. He said to her, daughter, your faith has healed you. Go in peace and be freed from your suffering.'" 